My name's Wendy Joyce. The work that I'm installing today is called After the Storm. It's an installation with four textile panels, which are eco-printed using leaves, mainly eucalyptus leaves, that I collected from my local area. Whenever I went walking around my local area, in the parks and around the streets, lots of eucalyptus um, were dropping branches after the storms and I was able to collect lots of eucalyptus leaves, which I then eco-printed onto large wool textile panels. Eco-printing is using the natural colours and shapes from the leaves. It's a direct imprint of the leaf onto the textile. I've always enjoyed the creative process. It's just a compulsion and obsession. I just see something and I want to do something with it. This work after the storm is a reflection of climate change and the, the crazy weather that we've been having this year. So it's using the resources that are provided by that bad weather. But it's also reflecting upon the after effects of that bad weather that we had. So not just people um, lost their homes and shelter, but also flora and fauna was, um, you know, damaged and um, destroyed in the, in the poor weather. So with the installation that I'm doing today, I'm using the arches to create a, a type of shelter um, using the wall panels and reflecting upon a sense of um, a safe space for everyone. The first challenge was working on the scale pieces that I'm working on. So I've never worked on such large um, fabric pieces before. So I've had to come up with a way of um, eco printing um, large bundles. I've had to use a large old laundry boiler with a garbage bin on top to create enough space to, to steam the, um, the panels. Um, so the, the panel, the textile panels are half boiled and half steamed. It's created different effects within the textile. And then, um, oh, it's just a fiddly install today with wires and drills and drilling, trying to drill into materials that don't want to be drilled into. <laughs> It's a beautiful garden environment. It's an amazing space. It has such a, a wide variety and lots of different options for artists to create and, and do something different. It's usually, you know, in a, an inside exhibition space with lots of white walls. So this is a really unique opportunity to, to really push the boundaries of what I've been doing with eco-printing before and working with textiles.